Good morning, and welcome to this week's edition of the Launchpad. I'm Cheyenne Finneybrock. Before we get started, I'd like to let everyone know that the September articles are now available on the Burn Uni website, so be sure to check those out. Now over to Abby with an update on BU Sports. Tonight, the football team takes on Worthington Christian at home in hopes of earning the title of league champs, which hasn't been done since 1994, so make sure you come out and support. This week in sports, girls volleyball won the league on Tuesday night against rival Fisher Catholic and won again last night against Miller to stay undefeated in the league. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2020 Burn Union football homecoming queen, Miss Cheyenne Finney. <laughs> Thanks, Abby. Last Friday was Burn Union's homecoming football game. The court consisted of freshman Gabby Mabry, sophomore Hannah Brown, and junior Samantha Hurst, along with our seniors Kelsey Esmond, Ashlyn Gherkin, Hannah Parker, and our 2020 homecoming queen, Cheyenne Finneyfrog. Thanks, Rachel, and welcome back to the weather with me, your favorite weatherman. I hope you're all ready for fall because colder temperatures are finally here. Today will be partially cloudy during the day with a high of 60. You'll want to make sure you're bundled up for tonight's game with the estimated temperature being 54 degrees at kickoff and continuously dropping into the night. Saturday will be cloudy with a high of 61 and low of 42 in the evening. Sunday will be cloudy in the morning and showers will begin in the afternoon and continue on to the late evening. The high will be 61 and low will be 41. I don't know about you, but I think this weekend's forecast will be perfect to get everybody in that fall mood. Now over to Ashton with an orientation recap. Uh, this Wednesday was orientation where we went over the new rules for the quarter, such as masks, social distancing, what entrances to use, lunch, and more. All this information can be found on the Burn Union Facebook page and the Burn Union website. Now over to Addie and Hannah for some student interviews. Thanks, Ashlyn. Last Friday, the Burn Union School Board decided to follow the green instruction model and return to in-person school. This change was unexpected to many parents and students. This week, we decided to interview some students to see how they felt about returning to the classroom. This is what they had to say. Personally, I'm excited to be going back to school because I'm going to be able to see people that I haven't seen since March. I'm also excited because I feel like I do better learning in a classroom setting instead of sitting at home in my bedroom by myself. I feel like I do better when I can interact with other people besides over a computer screen. But I'm also not excited because I'm not going to have a tour break anymore during the middle of my day. And I have to wake up two hours earlier and I'm not a morning person. I'm definitely excited to be going back to school because I miss seeing everyone. And I think that I learn better when I'm in an actual classroom. I'm excited to go back to school so I can finally see the friends I don't normally see in school. And so I can finally learn in person. Yeah, yeah I'm so excited for school. Yay, I can't wait to go back to school. Thank you to everyone who participated in interviews, and thank you for watching this week's edition of The Launchpad. We are excited to see you in person next week.